got him. Now a lot of you have been waiting for this video for a long time. I'm talking years. We are in the deep south. We are fishing the southern coast of Texas. So many comments always, come down to South Texas, come down to South. We're here. We've got a real close uh, family friend who lives down here. Fantastic fisherman. Finally set up a trip to come down here, get on his boat, and do some fishing. One interesting aspect though, it's blowing 20 or 30 miles an hour. It's windy as hell, that's all I know. Typically days like this I avoid, but my buddy Robert said, I wish it was windier. Apparently he's on some crazy windy bite. It requires a lot of wind and it's an afternoon bite. So he's like, come down at this time. This is the wind. So I'm gonna take his word for it. Not typically conditions that I fish in, but I know he knows what he's doing. So we're gonna give it a shot today. I'm talking windy guys, windy. Let's get it. Windy as hell, we're chasing birds, and I suck. Did you get one? Hard head? Hard head on a lure, that's good. That's a big school. You can see the mud under this bigger one. See them? Yeah, you move forward? I think they're gonna hopefully come this way. At this one? This one? Yeah, I can cast at this one. I'm gonna stop at something. Try to get fish on this one. There he is. It's a little red, I think. Or a trout. Is it still under that bird? Yeah, he's still under the bird. Whatever it is. Oh, it's a red. It's a little red? I think it's a red. The little one is Based on that wake, I think it's a red. I'm gonna put it down. Yeah. Oh, it's a big trout. <laughs> it's a nice trout. <laughs> oh my god. Are you kidding me? <laughs> god dang it. I don't think he's 23. Oh shit. <laughs> Holy. Are you kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? Twenty one. Oh, I got one. Yeah. Are we? Yeah, we're down, right? They're just sitting there. Oh, that's a good fish too. Oh yeah. Big head shaker too. Yeah. I don't know if he's that. No, he's not as big as yours, but he's a good one. Bigger than I've caught in a while. There you go. That's a slaughter. Yeah. <laughs> this is insane. Just insane. It's getting started. Jesus. Just keep her. 18 inches. Here we go. New slot, 17 to 23. We are keeping fish today. How big was yours? 20? Like 20, 20 and a half. He looked so much bigger than that. He did, right? He looked so much bigger than that. I was skeptical. Oh, I was like, I was like 30 mile an hour winds. How's this going to work? 
<laughs> you are not lying. They are everywhere. Yeah. And it's but, just, it is early right now. It's going to be more later. Basically, his idea. He's fished here a long time, so he knows. Water gets pretty clear down here, but with, with this wind, it dirties all the water up. The fish can't really see as much, and they're relying more on grouping up together and working together to get to eat. And those birds key in on that, and then you find them through that way. Yeah, basically what's happening is they're they're putting their noses and they're they're picking up grubs on the bottom and shrimp. And as they go along the bottom, they're kicking up the shrimp, so the seagulls are getting fed also. So they're easy to find. But this is dangerous right here because I know they're that. they're all on the water, so you can easily hook up. But so far, unbelievably, works really well. That's the cast. Yes? Yes, <laughs> I told you. It's a little trout. A little trout? Yeah. Came off. That's okay. He was small. He was small. <laughs> I'm a little right of them. Yep. 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 <laughs> Cast in there. I think it's dink trout, but... Oh, it's a decent trout, actually. Choked it. Oh, he choked it. Yeah. It's like 17 and a quarter. He choked it, though, so. Oh, you got one? Skipjack. Oh, blew out the school, though. Blew out the school. It's still there. Oh my gosh! Please be a trout. Oh, it's a little red. A little red? Yeah. Oh, shit. I set the hook. I was like, "Oh, please be a trout. That would be nice." Hey, I'll take it though. What up, bro? Sit. See ya, buddy. Uh, I'm ready when you are. Yeah. There we go. Good one? I don't know. It's, Hope it's not a skip jack. It kind of feels like a skip jack. It hit it really hard. Did it? Yeah. But he's not jumping. He's not jumping. And he's shaking his head. Not so I, it's a good, all good signs. It's a redfish. I think it's a keeper red too. Yeah. Can get I can get him, yeah. Come here. He's gonna be close, but he's really pretty. He's probably 19. What 20 and a half. Perfect. That's up to you. Yeah, keep him. Well, I'm gonna keep this. I can get fish in my relative. Yeah. That is always good, feeding the fam. Heck yes! That is what we're talking about right there. I just brought right into the bird, right into the bird. Yep. There you go. Oh, that's a big... It's a big trout. That's a, I hope so. It came up to the surface, but if it's a trout, it's a freaking giant. There's no way. There's no way. There's no way. Trout. There's no way. Yeah, it's a trout. But, I saw him. There's no way. He's not that that big, but he's big. There's no way. It's got to be a red. It's a red fish. Huh? It's a red. You sure? Yes. It's a big red. It's a nice red. Oh, that's a good red. <laughs> oh, he is pissed. There we go. There we go. Good job. Hell yeah. This is so, so good. They're still on the finish. Yeah, I know. It's a good group. This is a good group that's holding together. That's like, they're in such a feeding frenzy. That's how deep they're taking this stuff. It's a good thing we're keeping fish because 
these guys are doing some damage. You got pliers? Oh, I got it, I got it, I got it, yeah. 24. 24. Got him. Holy shit. I had something to eat this like right in front of us. Is it? Oh, that is a big fish. He did not know he was hooked. He had no idea. Unless he didn't know he was hooked. Nice. Let me get the net. He's not that big, but he's pretty good. Yeah. We take him. He got into that, like, going against... Wave. He got into the wave, like, against the way the boat was traveling, and... Good stuff. Now he's thick. Now we're killing it. Yeah, he's pretty thick. That's a thick fish, yeah. Heavy fish. Yeah, no need to be uh, subtle about this one. Uh, yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. The red. Yeah. I think I got a Really? Yeah. Double up? That's probably my limit of reds right here. Yeah. He's gonna be close to 20. Oh, don't you go back that way. How's that trout feeling? Good. Yeah? Good. He's like 18, like, well, maybe not. Maybe. We'll see. Oh, come on, buddy. I'm trying to get back in this school, my guy. And that mine too? Yep. Oh, he, <laughs> he jumped out, dude. <laughs> I got it. Yeah. He literally jumped out of the freaking net. He took the side. That's why it's so better than he did. Doubled up. Doubled up. There you go. <laughs> Try not to make too much of a mess of this. Nice. 21 easy, right? 21, yeah. Right at 18, 18 and a quarter. Hell yeah. yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six. So we're done with trout. We're done with trout. Good cast. You gotta get hit. You didn't get hit? No. I don't know how. I was right in the freaking middle of them. You're gonna get hit. Yeah. Immediately. There's. <laughs> It's swimming pretty red fishy. Yeah, I saw it. It looked like a trout. It made it close to red. It's a good red. Oh, where did he? I was like, where did he go? Oh! That's not a bad fish. No. Let me put this down. That might, one, right? that might be the bigger one of the day. Yeah. He's like probably 20. We got They're all like, they're all like 24 inches. Yeah. They're footballs, man. Yeah, they're pretty thick. Man. All on the white. Is that Z-Man? Yeah, that's all I throw. I mean, 99% of the time. Yeah. Oh. Kicked off. Oh my god. You lost him? Yeah. I mean he hit as soon as it hit the water. I mean he broke me off. Broke you off? He broke me off, yeah. That's wild. Jeez. I don't think I have time to retie that. I'm gonna have to pick something else up. Oh the bait caster with my name on it.
here it's a little windy. <laughs> Good stuff. Yeah, good stuff. I'll tell you what, this little boat is slick. I've never been on Robert's boat, but man, you can pretty much run it in absolutely nothing. That prop sits above the water line, so he said his boat will hit before anything, which is pretty freaking wild. Gotta say, shout out to Robert. I usually don't like fishing really, really high wind days like today. It does tend to be miserable, and it can be miserable, but I never really thought, I always did chase birds, but I never really thought about combining like a heavy wind day with that technique. That's all we did for three hours. Just chase birds, hop from school to school. Obviously good limit of trout, one short of a limit of reds. We caught a small red, a couple small reds, but so very, very solid day. Robert's taking the fish home to his family, which is really awesome. He always gives it, uh, gives it out. He's got a big family, so. I'm happy to, to help with that. It's good to see the fishery recovering from the freeze. There are so many fish out there right now. It is so, so good to see. Came south, you guys wanted to see it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Robert and I have some really cool stuff that we're cooking up. You may have seen a sneak peek of it today. I'll keep you guys informed. You're not gonna wanna miss out on that. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like. It helps us out a ton. Leave a comment. I'll answer as many comments as I can. Thank you guys for watching. We will see you on the next one.